What's going on guys? It's Rogue Samo. Finally doing a step by step tutorial. Finally. I just want to say first of all I appreciate you guys. I think I'm up to like eight hundred right now on Patreon and I just really appreciate you guys for sticking with me. And uh let's make this happen. I know it's like a little overdue, but uh I'm gonna walk you guys through step by step how I do it. Actually, so first of all, I will kind of show this one. Turn it up a bit. All right. So first of all, I am I do use a lot of circuit bending for the first intro. Let's see what's going on here. All right. So we can go ahead and see what I got pulled up. So I will not won't really show you guys like the original video because obviously I'm using After Effects to, to kind of create these so it's a little bit lagging right now but just kind of bear with me for a bit and you guys can kind of see exactly so this is my circuit bending kind of flow chart um, and I will go ahead and add this on to there on there but I do believe I might already have this file up on my Patreon so I do like to use this. I do shut off a few of these, right? So I don't feedback. Shut that off. Um, I mess with the comp, obviously. Super important. So I can kind of just show you guys kind of the things that I'm tweaking. Uh, I'm not tweaking too many things right now. Um, just because. Kind of show you just kind of what. Don't want that on, right? Go here, right? You can get a cool photo difference. But uh, let's go ahead and just view something else as well. I do like to uh, view this displays. Not like that, right? Go ahead and throw that in there, right? I like that. So far, we can go ahead and take a better look at that. Mm. Take a look at that. I like that. I like how that's looking. All right, we just kind of mess with that. Real time on. Right. So I'm kind of just going for like a vibrant color. Boom. So throw that in there. I like that. And then I'll kind of show you guys step two here. I turn the real time off. I got a lot of things running as you see. Okay, boom. So then I'll throw this into my blob tracking, right? Everyone likes a great blob track. You can kind of mess with this a little bit. And everything is going a bit slow just because as I'm obviously recording my screen, I got a lot of stuff going on. So we'll leave that real time off for now. We'll throw that on there, right? Throw a nice little blob tracking. Um, important that the threshold is where you want it. I think that's important. You can throw that, throw that on there as well. Um, yeah, so this is my blob track, and it's a little bit different than others, but I do believe I have my blob track and tail file up. So you guys should be able to go ahead and just emulate this. So first we start with the circuit bending, and then I do like to go to the blob tracking sometimes, or switch it up a little bit, whatever order you guys feel like is, uh, is best. All right. Turn the real time on for a bit just to kind of see how it looks. Oh, so I told it's a bit high for me. We'll turn it up actually. A bit low for me, excuse me. But we don't want to track everything, but we want to basically track the body, all right? I like that. Awesome. I'll kind of show you guys my next step here. 
Awesome, awesome, awesome. So next, I normally will mess with the displays, right? So the displays kind of mess with it a little bit. I won't kind of show you my uh, like. Normally, I might throw another video on top just to kind of give it a little bit of depth of field. But for right now, I'm just using kind of a PNG file, so my logo right there. So. And to be honest, that's, that's pretty much it. And then, uh, yeah, I do most of all my after, you know, ed edits are going to be, you know, on Premiere. Or honestly, even if you have like iMovie or something like that, I'm on a Mac, which is not ideal for Touch Designer, but it's uh, kind of what I got. So, yeah, so yeah, they're kind of those, those three files, and you can pretty much pull the same effect that, I, that you guys wanted. Probably not gonna be my best video, but I just want to say thank you guys so much for getting me where I'm at, and uh, yeah, give me feedback. I would like to uh, get better at this, so thank you guys. And I hope that you guys can play around with this. I will go ahead and and post something else on my Patreon with all three of these, all three of these uh, files, so you can just kind of go through them. You don't have to mix them up. I think it's kind of better to kind of use them separately. Um, that way, you can kind of tweak it a bit, and then you can always go back if you. If you find like, you know what, uh, maybe I want a higher blob track. So I didn't export and all that, but these are the three that I used. And everything after that would be kind of After Effects and uh, uh, Premiere iMovie. So thank you guys so much. I love you guys so much. Signing off.